Hey everyone, it's Killer King here, and we're going to be doing another Let's Play of The Walking Dead. Alright, so now we are going to be feeding people. Or well, four, four people since we don't have that much food. So let's go feed the kids first. How you doing, Clementine? Okay. Where's your hat? I don't know. Can you help me find it? Yeah, of sure. course. When did you lose it? I had it a couple days ago. I promise. If I find it, I'll let you know. Thank you. You're okay, welcome. Claire. I've got to take care of some things. Why don't you go back to playing with Duck for a while? Okay. <sighs> Here, Clem. You need something to eat. Uh, have an apple. I love apples. Thank you. Are there more? No. Sadly, no. There's the last one. Oh, um. Enjoy it. Just enjoy, enjoy it while it lasts, Clementine. Alright, Duck. Hey, Duck. How about a little food? Pretty sure your kind would like yeah. jerkies. Yeah. Oh, man, I'm so hungry. I'm sure you are. What about you, Carly? Here. Me? How about you? You look like crap, Lee. <laughs> Here's the Thanks. last time you ate. I'm okay. I'm, I'm good. Don't this, worry. Okay? In case you or Clementine starts feeling weak. I know I said it didn't matter why you saved me instead of Doug, but... You don't owe me anything, Carly. Oh, man, she's still... Sad about Doug? Ah, uh, that's not good. Ken? Want something to eat? Here, Kenny. Take this. How about my boy? He eat yet? Uh, yes. Yeah, fed him. Something. Sure. Then hand it over. I'm starved. Thanks. You're welcome. I would keep it by his cap. The power bar at the drugstore, so oh, some of these give it to someone else. Me They're the ones that need it. Uh, I guess going, Mark would like some. From up here, it looks like you're playing favorites. That's uh. Alright, guessing they're over here. Will you hold the damn board steady? I'm trying. I, I didn't realize I was getting this weak already. What do you want? A handout? Oh, I got 60 cents in my pocket. If you'll shut up and quit being such a pansy. Want something, hey, Mark? You holding up okay, Lee? I was pretty fucked up back there. I'm gonna cut that guy's leg off. Yeah, I just hope Kaja can save him. Uh, uh, here, pizza. All I have left is crackers and cheese, so yeah. Thanks, Lee. Need oh, okay. help the wall? Nope. Actually, we could use your axe. Do you mind if we take it? Uh, yeah, yes, of course. Thing for a bit. Here, Here Mark, go, Mark. Thanks. Hey, I'm the one doing all the work over here. You didn't think to give me I don't care axe? what you're doing, Larry. Come on. All right? Give it Damn. a rest, man. Things are different. Being a racist is outdated. Oh, and that's what you think this is? Well, it seems like it since me and you are the exactly. only ones who are fighting. So, yeah, that's yeah, right. That's right. And what are you going to do about it? Look, I don't care what it is, but you two have got to start trying to get along. The only thing I have to do is protect my daughter. And right now, that means getting this damn wall <sighs> So I would appreciate it if you two would shut up and let me get back to work. I uh, see what you cause now, Mark. Well, I'm all done, Lily. Not such an easy job, is it? Never said it. It was okay. I don't envy you. I don't know how you have the strength to do this every day. I don't have a choice. Hey, thanks for looking out for me and my family. Oh, no problem. Still, 
I guess some people aren't going to be happy with your choices. That's true. You're out? What happened to my food? There's none left. You keep treating people like this, and your days in this group are numbered. You're one to talk, old man. Yeah, well, I don't see you working on that wall. Well, Larry, do you mind going? Yeah, there you go. Ken, Lee, come here, please. Come in, Kenny's mom. He didn't make it, did he? He lost too much blood. God damn it. I'm getting sick of this shit. Well, me too, Ken. Ken. come back. There's nothing... I'm sick of this shit, too. You don't think I am? Uh, I don't know. Maybe it's for the best. We're already struggling to feed our own kids. That man you brought, I tried, but he was never going to survive. Well, at least he's not our problem anymore. That's true. What about the other kid? Uh, I don't know. Oh, what the? What in the? Oh, my goodness. Come on, hurry, give that, or get, give me the axe. I thought this guy wasn't even bit. Go! Hit, hit! Oh, come on, Mark. Great. Kick attack. Wait, what? Oh. Get away from me. Shoot! Oh, Mark, come on. Ouch. Uh. Mark, hurry up! Oh. Thank you, Carly. Oh, my goodness. You okay? Yeah. Thanks. Why'd you bring him here in the first place, asshole? Dad, calm down. You're gonna get us all killed! Keep yelling, Larry. You said he wasn't bitten. What? We asked you point blank, was he bitten, and you said no. He wasn't. Well, you're not then why did he turn into a walker? And tried to kill my wife. What? Wait, you all don't know? What the hell are you talking about? It's not the bite that does it. What? You come back no matter how you die. If you don't destroy the brain, that's just what happens. It's gonna happen to all of us. My God. God help us. It makes sense. In those first few days, it's been so fast. Car accidents, suicides. Everything was making more of them. When I first Great. saw it happen, we were all hiding out in the gym, and everybody thought we were finally safe. But one of the girls, Jenny Pitcher, I think, I guess she couldn't take it. She took some pills, a lot of them. Someone went in the girls' room the next morning, and... God. Back off! Whoa, lady, relax. Me and my brother, we... We just want to know if y'all can help us out. I said back off, Harley. Good, quiet. Uh, we don't want no trouble. Don't want any trouble. Of course, neither do we. I'm Andy St. John. This here's my brother, Dan. We're just out looking for gasoline. Looks like you folks got the motel locked down, which, which is fine, but uh, if you spare any gas, well, we'd be much obliged. Should we? Why do you need gas? Our place is protected by an electric fence. Generators provide the electricity. Our generators run on gas. Look, we own a dairy farm a few miles up the road. If y'all be willing to lower your guns, we, we can talk about some kind of trade. How y'all doing on food? We got plenty at the dairy. Could use this opportunity. Lee, why don't you and Mark check the place out? See if it's legit. I'm going with you. I got your back if anything seems fishy. Awesome. So, uh, what do y'all think? Uh, sure. We got a deal. We'll bring some gas to your dairy. In exchange, you give us some food to bring back. We'll see how it goes from there. Sounds fair. A couple gallons should power one of our generators for a while. Sounds good. So, this dairy, you guys really have food? Or do? We lost most of the cattle, but we still have oh, lots of good. milk, butter, and cheese stocked up. And with oh, the vegetables okay. we grow, we got plenty of food. It's nice to get away from that motel for a while. 
This Lily Kenny thing is starting to get ridiculous. Personally, I'd be happier if you started to take charge more. Uh, you think they'd want me for me? Sure. Everybody looks up to you. Well, of course. Not everyone thinks I'm so trustworthy. Because of your past. Does anyone else know? Uh, Larry knows. Larry knows. Great. That can't be easy. Not the good time. Mike know. He was there when we were talking in the drugstore. He asked me about it. I lied to him, but... What exactly did happen with the senator? Uh, let's see. Uh, you know what happened. You know what happened. I only know what the press was told. I don't know your story. Sometimes I wonder if I should talk to the group about it. You don't have to. Whatever happened before things went to hell doesn't matter anymore. That's I'm true. Sure everyone would see it that way. Maybe you're right. Listen, over the years, I've reported on some pretty messed up shit. I've seen situations like yours a hundred times. It doesn't so? have to make you a bad man. I uh, really appreciate that. I mean, thank God Lee showed up when he did. Right, Lee? Oh, back yeah, and why works. don't you tell us a little more about yourself, Lee? Where are you from? Uh, grew up in Lee? California. I hear the heart of John. That's what I like to hear. Y'all seem pretty settled in at that motor in the... Who's running things over there? Uh, Ken. Kenny's a guy who really keeps a group together. <laughs> Don't let Lily hear you say that. How many people you got over there anyway? Nine and two the kids. You forgot Ben. Me? Oh. That makes it ten. Oh, well, part of us? we'd love to get you all out to the dairy. Like I said, we got plenty of food, and quite frankly, we could always use an extra helping hand. In the summers, I used to help out on a goat farm. Yeah, that's, that's great. That's cool, Ben. Everything helps. Right now, Mom's really been don't care. dairy for well, as long as I can remember, but now it's... You think you're going to cut me out of this? What was that? Damn. No one's trying to cut you out of anything. You and Gary are always fucking the bandits. Who? Those look like the people who oh, raided man. my camp. Fuck you! You knew we were hungry, and you guys were keeping up. There's only two of them. Oh no, there's yeah, you know what? He ate it all. Uh, the bullet's not worth it, Carly. Don't worry, Danny and I got you. Besides the noise too, so yeah. Let's just wait this out. Don't they move on? Fuck you! Fuck you! Fuck you! Jesus! My God. Four bullets wasted and one man down. Come down here and go to shit. Come on, let's get to the dairy where it's safe. <laughs> All right, let's check out this farm or the dairy. St. John's oh. Family Day. Reminds me of Herschel's farm. Well, Y'all can see how we kept this place so safe. It's even clean, That's too. Keeps them out. You betcha. They fry like bugs in a zapper. We're pushing 4,000 volts through that thing with generators and amps. I'm going to assume that's a lot. This is pretty this good. This is a really brilliant setup. Suits us just fine. This place looks untouched. You never know the rest of the world is in ruins. It's worth protecting. Hence all the juice. I thought I saw y'all with company coming down the drive. Guys, this is our mom. I'm Brenda St. John, and welcome to the St. John Dairy. This here's Lee. He's from Macon. A couple of our old farm hands were from Macon. They grow them good there. <laughs> We've got a few more friends staying at the old motel. Oh my goodness, that place is pretty vulnerable. Have you got someone with survival experience to lead your group? Uh, yeah. Kitty's working on getting us somewhere safer. He doesn't think the motor end will stay safe forever. Sounds like it's Mark May. Now it that sure you're is. here, we'll make sure you're safe and comfortable. Uh... Does that offer apply to the rest of us? We're all incredibly hungry. Thank you for y'all. 
Thanks, Francis. Good morning. Amazing.